Leo. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited for this reading. Um, somebody is going to meet somebody, okay? And it's Leo. <clears throat> so you're coming in hot and spicy in the seductive, okay? Now, this other person is coming up as the mirror, the coffee cup, the phoenix, and the wedding rings. So much energy coming from this other person. You have no idea, okay? This person that you're going to be meeting, that a Leo is going to be meeting, okay, has been on their own for a very long time, okay? Um, you guys are separated, okay? The separation card is in the middle. You do not know each other. I even tried to pull in the tarot, so I was like, you know, past, present, future, and they're like, there is no past. These people don't know each other, and I was like, oh my gosh, this is like, you are meeting somebody brand spanking new, okay? Now, <clears throat> friends in limbo, coming up this person does not want to be friends with you and you are going to notice because maybe you know in the past you're used to like kind of you know meeting somebody and being like okay like let's be friends you know you try to get in with them as a friend this person no there is no friends okay this isn't a friendship this is going to be a very tight lovers bond very quickly because in the in just after this you guys decide that you are not going to be friends the lovers came out so i was like okay so um, you choose to be together, okay? You choose to be together. Um, and this is, this is both your wishes. You know, like he, you might not believe it, but surprisingly, there are a lot of men that want just as much as a woman does. You know, like, okay, that sounded weird. Like, you know, there, there are men that want romance. You know, there are men that want to wine and dine and take care of a woman, surprisingly. Despite what my father says, okay? There are really nice men out there, okay? So, I was like, future, what's going to happen in the future? Eight of swords in, on the side, to just to let you know you're both going to be wrapped up in this. So, you're not going to want to leave. Okay, it's not a bad card, okay? It's just letting me know physically what is going to happen. So I was like, and, and that kind of goes along with this. So I do believe that the guy is going to say something. So if you're a guy, I feel like you're going to point something out with a girl. And if you're a woman, somebody is going to see you. And the thing is, is like, this is kind of how it plays out. So he is looking at her. Okay. So, but it's moon in reverse. So nobody sees this. It hasn't happened. It's completely in the dark because that's the thing is we can't even, we can't even predict the future. You know, like you have to go down the road and go to the plaza that leads to the coffee shop that leads to the guy that wants to take you to a coffee, you know, or the guy you have to decide that you're going to go to Starbucks that day. Like you have to make the decisions because if, if it's in your head that day that you're going to do this thing, you know, you're going to go for a walk on, on your lunch break, or you're going to go and you're going to get some French fries at this French fry truck. Like, you know, when you say it, that gets put out to the world of like, okay, this is my itinerary. This is what I'm going to do for the day. Okay. Then somebody else says, oh, you know, I, I haven't been to that chip truck before. I think I'm, I think I'm going to go today for some random reason. You pass it, you know, and you pull over, boom, there's your meet and greet. There's your meet cute, you know, like, like something to, something to do with coffee. Like there's some type of meeting and conversating and like this person knows that they want to do it. Okay. This is also a mirror. So you two mirror each other very nicely. Okay. You both have the same ideas of commitment and you're both in new phases of your life and a new point of regrowth in your life. Okay. So when this meeting happens, you're ready for it. You're not going to run away from the cute guy this time. You're not going to, you know, smirk and rev your engine in front of the hot girl. You're going to actually say something. Maybe you have seen this person before, or maybe you haven't. I, I definitely know you don't know each other, okay? I definitely know you don't know each other. And this, this, the guy says something. Okay, what does the guy say? Because, like, you get all flirty and, like, oh, probably start acting a fool. But this person is so attracted to it that it's like, oh, my God, look what they're doing. 
they're being all flirty and you like bat your eyes. All right, what is it? Okay, yeah, yeah. What does the guy want to say? The guy talks first. Let's see. Okay, let's Four of Cups, Five of Cups, Five of Wands, Knight of Swords. This just really threw me off. I don't know why. This four and five of cups, I can't sit in silence anymore because that's just weird. Four and five of cups has completely, I don't even know what that's about. This five of wands, um, knight of swords, it seems like they're going to come at you and say they'll fight for you. Which is like so renaissance, if you think about it. But maybe they're like, maybe you seem down. Like you might, you might look sad that day and they're like, I will fight a million dragons for you. And you're like, ha, ha, ha. You know, maybe it's not like something to make you laugh. You might be sad. And you also might have your kid with you. You might have a kid. And you, you know, you guys both might look like kind of sad when, when he sees you. And he's just looking at you like, oh my gosh, I will go to the top of the mountain for you. And, and that's where something comes out. Maybe, maybe this person doesn't really know what to say. But they say something because you guys don't know each other. So it's kind of like awkward. You know, it might be awkward. It might be awkward. Anything else? Anything else want to be said here? Six of Pentacles. Well, he does want you to know he has money. He also might have kids. And they have a very, very good relationship. So maybe he's like, oh, you have a son. I have sons too. You know, something like that. Some, that might come up like that. And if, you know, you're by yourself. I mean, I can't. I, I'm so lost all of a sudden. I'm like, maybe, you know, I wasn't supposed to pull in that energy. I wasn't supposed to ask what y'all want to say to each other because it's going to be so spontaneous. You're not going to be thinking, like, what did Moonshine say again? Anyways, Leo, I'm going to leave it at that. This is so great, okay? This is so great. You get to meet somebody and it's new and it's fresh and it's exciting. And I just want to say congratulations and I hope it's you. Thank you.